Bristol, the new queen, substituted for the king, who was absent for political reasons, at the head of the kingdom, which she rules in the most selfish way. Beautiful Snow White, innocent and resigned victim of her stepmother's wickedness, spends her days alone and sad. Her only company is the loyal Molly and her three small pets. Molly! Stop shouting, Snow White. Molly is gone. She was too tired and I gave her some days off. Molly, I looked for you everywhere all night long. I am so tired. I fell asleep right here with these clothes. <gasps> Milk. Pocket. Cuckoo. Why did you leave me? <laughs> because she was tired of taking care of you. <gasps> Mother. She was tired of nursing you. She couldn't stand it anymore, and so I decided to dismiss her. That can't be true. She would never say such a thing. Are you saying I'm a liar? Oh! Don't you dare doubt my words, Snow White. And watch out. Being beautiful does not necessarily assure you everybody's love and appreciation. And now get rid of those awful beasts. I won't tolerate them. Why? I don't understand. Yesterday you told me I could take them outside. True. And now I want you to take them to the woods with you and leave them there. No, I won't leave them. Be careful, Snow White. You better obey my orders. <laughs> oh. If that brat thinks she'll interfere in my projects, she'll be disappointed. Mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the fairest of them all? You, my queen, there is no doubt. No doubt. <laughs> Shut up, there is nothing to laugh about. Yes, I am a great queen. A queen of beauty and elegance. Everyone will bow at my feet and know that I am the most beautiful of all. <laughs> Molly isn't here anymore. I feel so lonely. I need you, Father. Come back soon. Wait, Your Highness. You can't do that, especially not now. Don't forget that our king is away, and this year has not been very profitable for one of our farmers. The people are hungry. They will misunderstand your actions. Do you also need a vacation? What? Listen carefully what I'm going to say, Counselor. First of all, send the invitations to all the surrounding kings. Then hire the best cooks tailors, and amusing jugglers you know. And then clean this castle from top to bottom. I want this to be the greatest party this castle ever had. The queen will give a party. Oh, what a great 
nice part of the table. I should leave it. Oh, I thought it was something as soon as I Oh, I would put it in the studio. It's nice too. What's that? Welcome, my honorable guests. I gave this party to gather you here so that you, representatives, diplomats, and rulers of the surrounding regions, could meet in such a happy occasion and start working towards a truce. We must suspend the hostilities and enjoy happy and long-lasting peaceful times. Please do not let me down. Where are you, Molly? Snow White? Yes? Come on, the time has come to welcome our guests. Yes, Mother. Please feel welcome to my father, King Conrad's castle. I hope you will spend a pleasant evening in our company. Oh, that's Snow White. She's so elegant and refined. Her beauty is not inferior to the Queen herself. Never before have I seen a face so perfect. She's so elegant. The green ribbon in her hair makes her look like an angel. I've never seen such a lovely girl before. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, may the dancers start. Oh, right. I love to dance. I can't dance. I'm Snow White? Snow White? Yes? The dress you're wearing looks very good on you. Truly beautiful and sophisticated. Thank you, Mother, for your compliment. But there's one problem. That ribbon you're wearing spoils it. Take it off now. What? You can't wear it. It isn't suitable for a princess of your status. Oh, but Mother, I like it. I'm sure you can go find another one instead of this. Music. Play music. <laughs> Trying to cheer me up and make me smile again, right? <laughs> Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Oh. Cuckoo, what are you looking at? Oh, a rainbow. <laughs> you found me. <laughs> now it's your turn to hide. I'll start counting. 
One, two, three. There you are. I finally caught you. <laughs> they seem to like him very much. I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean to scare you. Uh, what? You fell in the bushes. Did you hurt yourself? Oh no, I am sorry. Are they friends of yours? Yes. They're Cuckoo, Milk the Dog, Pocket the Cat. Oh, what lovely names. <laughs> Thank you. Let me help you. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm Richard Albertville. Oh, and I am... Princess Snow White, right? Oh, yes, but how do you know my name? <laughs> Before coming down here, I was in your castle. At the party, you mean? Yes, with my father, but I prefer the woods. It's calmer here. And also, all those things bore me a lot. <laughs> huh? Blue ribbon looks great, too. Oh. The ribbon on you now is very nice. However, I think the other one looked much better on you. The green one, right? Oh, my ribbon, you found it. I like it very much. <laughs> Is that your horse, Richard? Yes, my father gave it to me. His name is Alexander, and he is a loyal friend. He's beautiful. I've never ridden a horse. It must be marvelous. I would like to ride someday. I will grant you your wish next time we meet. I promise. But... I would love to see you again, Princess. May I please? Oh... Oh, good morning, Your Highness! How many times must I repeat that you cannot hit the dishes with your fork? Oh, I won't do it again. Huh? I don't like this. That little fool is in such a good mood, I even lost my appetite. Why is she so happy? Mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the fairest of them all? The head, why don't you answer me? It is you, my queen. Why didn't you say no doubt? I've never wandered so deep into the woods before. It's fabulous. I've never seen such a view. We are at the top. From here, you have the best view over the beautiful Green Valley. Look, my castle seems so small. It's true. To think you were born there. Richard, uh, this is for you. A clover. People say it's a good luck charm, and I'm giving it to you to wish you all the best during your life. Take it. Thank you. I will keep it with me. Oh, I wish this day would never die, that the sun would never set. <laughs> you run fast. Come here. <laughs> oh, do I? <laughs> oh, Milk, please forgive me. Poor Milk, please excuse us. Excuse us. Sit under the sun.
What is it, Richard? Is something wrong? What? Uh, nothing. Please, tell me. You know, the more time passes, the more beautiful you get. Oh. Uh, ri Richard? Thank you. <laughs> mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the fairest of them all? It is... I'm listening. You, you my queen, queen, are very beautiful. Mm -hmm. But in but this in castle, castle, there is a lady as pretty as a flower. It is Snow White. I asked who is the most beautiful woman, and you talk about Snow White? Are you kidding me? At the top there is place for just one person, so who is it? You, my queen, no doubt about it. Of course I am. That little brat is too young to compete with a woman so beautiful as I am. <coughs> Shut up now! <coughs> Richard, look. Huh? The woods constantly change its colors. In spring, yellow. In summer, blue. And in autumn, rusty red. What about the winter? That we shall see together, right? Oh, yes, of course. Do you promise? I promise. <laughs> oh, Milk, what are you doing? Milk, wait for us! Oh. Oh, Richard, what is it? Snow White, would you like to visit me at my castle tomorrow? What? Would you? I don't know. I'd be very happy. My father and all his friends expect you to come and they will love to see you. But before telling everyone I would go visit, you should have asked me first, Richard. You're right. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Are you mad? Yes, of course I am. I acted like a fool. <laughs> huh? Now tell me, what time should I be there? <laughs> what? Really? So you... <laughs> Good morning, sir. I hope you sell all your jewelry. <laughs> Thank you. Surely this jewel will do well to my natural envied beauty. Not that I need it, of course. Your Highness, I think this gem will look great on Snow White. Let me see. Why Snow White? Well, Your Highness, I thought your princess was still a child, but I just saw her on my way here, and I noticed she is a beautiful and charming girl. She is even prettier than her late mother. I thought she might need a jewel. Is there something wrong, Your Highness? Yes, you! Leave this room! Oh, Your Majesty, I didn't mean any bad... Why are you upset? Don't insist! Get out! Uh, yes. <sighs> mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the fairest of them all? And I want the truth! It is... It is Snow, Snow White. White. What? Snow White, you'll taste a bit of my anger! Ugh. Richard, my prince. Snow White, from now on, you will remain in your room till I allow you to leave, is that clear? But... No buts, you must obey me, you hear me, or you will regret it. Queen ordered Snow White to stay in her room. She's sad. Soon she will disobey the Queen's order and leave the castle with her friends to meet Prince Richard, unaware of the price she'll pay for it later. The princess will be forced to live adventurous and tragic experiences imposed by a wicked and cruel destiny.